also left. Ahoy everyone, welcome aboard. I'll be your Captain Alien tonight, along with... Are you so mighty Lieutenant Rukia at your service? Let's get that off. There we go. <laughs> Much better. Okay, and welcome back to Sonic Adventure 2. Hopefully with less glitchy mods this time. Because I did some testing and, well, I think I figured out which were causing issues. Apparently the better Miles mod, which was supposed to, well, improve some things with his uh, movement, but it ended up sealing his mech. And apparently this, the Dreamcast Shadows mods was the one that was, well, for one, causing the messy shadows, but also the first thing to lock up during uh, the ending of Knuckles' missions for some reason. Okay. <clears throat> and yeah, last time we got started on this game where, well, <laughs> Sonic got captured by the federal government because uh, this motherfucker was up to shit. <laughs> Okay. I'm Knuckles, the Echidna. Just call me Knuckles. We were able to locate Eggman's secret base deep inside the pyramid. Now we need to find the key to open the door to get to the other side. What? Why do I have to find that key? That's not my job, but I'll do it. I have to because it's for the Master Emerald. I'll show you the skills that make me the ultimate treasure. <laughs> Okay, I kind of like this dialogue. It's really a bit smoother. Yeah. It... Okay, that's just <laughs> for a moment I thought that the uh, shadows glaze anyways, but no, it's because there's flickering flames. Okay. Yeah, most of the other mods do still work, like the one that will no, gives a better radar, or rather unlocks the other <clears throat> unlocks the other parts of the radar, so that we don't actually need to uh, yeah find them in order. I uh, can notice something here. Hmm? I think that you, you know when it says Aurora. Yeah. Right. Nothing right. That's Japanese. I'm pretty sure it is. Yeah. Golden Goddess. Okay. Yeah, don't you see the some some fighting? Hmm. Look, I forgot what the those were means. No clue. Could, could just be a random combat noise because, well, games are full of those. Okay. True. Oh, yeah. the, all the times I heard uh, people kind of say that it's like, beside digging, just with all your. Trying to the pummel one with your a lot of rapid punches. Yeah. Like Jojo is filled with those sounds and random noises. Yeah. It, I don't know, it could just be a sort of a Sean mantra or something like that. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, the heck can we even go here? Yes, yes, oh my child, shut up. It almost looks like we're locked to this this tiny room and okay, nice detail I've given that and let the flames actually hurt us if we get too close. Where the green flame is? Okay, let's not fly in the red flame. I'm pretty sure we're not supposed to be able to break these. Why is that lighting up around it? There's something pointing something flashing in the red zone. Or I, oh no, I think it's a you are here map, I think. Okay. Is yeah. there some mechanism to open up the doors? I the guess only the place we can go is room. over actually anything over here. Oh yeah, these can be destroyed. And hello. Hammer gloves. Increases your punch attack power. Now break iron containers with just a punch. Okay. Okay, my fault for not noticing that there was that on the sides. 
Oh, I, I think I know why they're calling them old enough hammer punch. Who? Yeah. They're calling them power knuckles would be rather confusing. Yeah. <laughs> but those are literally not yep. power knuckles or knuckles. Yep. Knuckles is knuckles. Wait, now with extra knuckles. <laughs> and a side of oh, knuckles. <laughs> okay, this place is going to be an outer nuisance. See, purple Blue flames. Yeah. Green flame. So I'm presuming it's going to be in this area here. Painkillers? Hmm. Yes, people, I'm still sick. I thought it was yeah. maybe it's getting slightly better, but. Yep. Yeah, wake up four in the morning, I need to go to the bathroom. For only pleasant experience. Yeah. 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 But now, the full steam. I've been seeing that slightly tired, but I got lazy. I thought, alright, it's getting a little bit better. But not, not long ago, I started with the nausea and a bit earlier stuff, a bit of pain. In my belly, now I have pain in my neck, probably because I've been laying bad. So, yeah, thank you, thank you, and now with my sandwich. Yeah. Again, if it ever does g uh, get too much, just say so, and we can uh, take a break with streams. Blue uh, path. I'm for you. I'm gonna go you. The streams kind of help me in some way, for it keeps me away from being bored and uh, yeah, it cheers me up a bit. <laughs> As well, less lonely. And that was just another prime example of Omachow being absolutely useless because they had warned us about a trap after it landed on our head already. Oh dear. Oh yeah. I guess it, this stream helps a little bit. But yeah, I will tell you if it gets uh, too much. Let's see, on the U-shaped ledge on the path that looks like stairs. Okay. But yeah, the pain is not too bad. Just, yeah, I just think it being is just to make sure it doesn't get worse. Okay. Another fake gamma. Okay. Uh, what did it say? Green path or red path? Um. Um. Yeah, either way, we can smash through here now. <laughs> okay, I'll give him a point for that. <laughs> but I'll subtract it for that. And of course, it's. A <laughs> of course, there's a skunk in there because that was a real stinker of a trap. Let's see. Nothing else in this room. Ah. Oh, I was expecting. <laughs> I was expecting to find the hourglass, but no, we found a bomb instead. <laughs> Okay. Hmm. Just enough. Wait. Okay, balls that look like that are going to be uh, <clears throat> ones that we can dig through. So, More what, useless that, info. I still wonder, is, is that... Were those made by tails? Okay. By who? Miles, tails, <laughs> Miles, Trower. Yeah, I, I don't know if it's ever said who made Omachow. But I do know that most everyone just does not like them in any sort of out way. Uh, uh, oh, that was close. Yeah, but I know that they sometimes sound like tails at times. I almost speak like tails at times. And similar voice actor, maybe. Okay, we're getting close we'll to the next key. 
Do not also be surprised if, if they were made by Tails and they just uh, recorded a voice for them. Okay, not that way. Did. Okay, <laughs> come on. <laughs> At least those jump scares don't actually hurt. Okay, getting closer. You should probably say this. Yeah, we are a little bit on er extra early Sonic today, it sounds uh, William was a bit unavailable for off the news stream today. Yeah. This wasn't really feeling up for it then. Okay, that's going to be pretty useless here. Uh, let's see... It, yeah, that's very useless since he just bounces all over the place. It's closer. Yeah. Right. Is it up here? Oh, also, get rid of you. Okay, so <laughs> the fake Omegas had it, but not Omegas, Gammas. Omega makes their appearance later in the series. What does this activate? Sort of lucky that it doesn't crush us. Gorilla's chase? Okay. What? Get rid these. And we're back in the center. Drink. Is there another screen somewhere we can get a... Yep. Another hint from. In the ground. That's not going to help any. But it'll tell us that we need to dig around for it. But that's about it. We need something more specific. Also, I'm pretty sure grabbing those gives us access to the, the Chow Gardens for the region. Dead end room on the path. The Dead green room. room. Okay. Then to the green room we go. It's red. Here's green. Okay. Okay, it's the dead end, so probably the right coming up, according to the maps. We've <laughs> just squeezed through that, but not through that. Uh, yeah, it's in there somewhere. Okay. There. Closer. Oh, gorillas! Yep. Yeah. Fuck off, you two. No. No. No, no we just... There we go. Okay, can be rather annoying with how precise you need to be with the digging, at least. That was tough. <sighs> oh dear. And yeah, because we got the key, we got dropped off here. Let's see, Chow Kindergarten. Maybe we need to maybe need to get the keys so we can actually drop off these things. But may as well do that now just to get rid of them. And it doesn't look like any of the eggs have hatched. Okay. Oh well. Again, not not much we have interest in here. Huh? Who's there? What the a ghost? <laughs> King Boom Boom? Really? Well, time to play Ghostbusters then, huh? Okay, I have absolutely no idea how to beat this thing. Oop. Oh, I thought it was going... <laughs> Okay, now we know why Boom Boom 
Oh, okay. We need to... We need to find the smaller ghosts. Okay, and now he's on the ground, so... Nope. There we go, we dig him out. And then we slap his ass. Okay, repeat that three more times and we should be done. So, ignore the big guy. Get the small fry. Okay, go for the small fry when he's too busy belching flames. It shows the, the thing like for half a second or so. Yes, yes, oh my child, shut up. If you give useful tips sometimes, but most of the times you're just stating the obvious. Yep, there we go. Yeah, I would say those other computer things we ask tips for are more useful. Okay, maybe we can plant two hits. <laughs> Sit still and come here. Uh, no. I might have been able to get a hit in there if there was like a second faster. Okay. Throw flame, throw flame, throw flame. Another one, and another one, and another one. And then he just starts belching. Okay. Simple enough. Now he's going up the walls. Okay, that's not going to help you. <laughs> not when our character is literally a digger. Yeah, yeah. 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 His way is power gloves yeah. and shovel gloves. Okay. Yeah, that's a new. Okay, good thing that we're still pretty speedy, huh? Okay, one, two, three, and four, and then you start to start belt. No, five, six. There he goes. Nope. Okay, where are you going to hide this time? Just on the ground again? No, nope, back on the walls. Which is actually easier for us to grab because we don't have to aim <laughs> ahead of you. Can I get another hit? Nope. Okay, last one. It's definitely a bit different, but still. Can we really say that this is too interesting? <laughs> and the one, and the two, and the three, four, five, and six, seven, eight. Okay, yeah, he, he just throws more for every time we do get eight up. Really? The small fry hurts us? Okay. Oh, God. Uh, yeah. Get over here and surrender your throne. Something about him is weird. Like, he, I don't know. Something like he, he does the beat this game for some reason. Yeah. It is just completely out of nowhere. Just ghost. And it's not even a machine or something pretending to be. Okay. That was pretty rough. We did it! Let's go, Amy! Yeah. You little thieves! Did you really think eh? you could get out of here alive? Come and get some, Eggman! Sonic! I'm my Just leave it to me! This time, I'll 
take your lives, as well as the Chaos Emerald. I call on you to destroy these pests. Come out, my servant. Um. If no, there's the robots. Oh, well, hey. Golem? Ed Golem. I was right. It, you almost got hit by that. Of course, I end up hitting the underside and drowning in quicksand. <laughs> <laughs> well, Sonic oh, may be the fastest yeah. thing alive, but he's not quicker than quicksand. It's a bit hard when it spins as fast as we go. Yeah. Um. Okay, so it's not just instant death in case you fall. Still a good chance of death. Okay, after attacking it, it gives a, a good window to climb up to its head. Okay, I should have waited for it to lower down. You'd think this would be a pretty big design flaw, which it totally is, <laughs> so... Oop. Okay, they retract for a while, but they come out... Oh, no, they start pull pushing in and out. Okay, I'll just skip the last one. <laughs> Eep. Okay, it's actually useful to have some of these down. There we go. Okay. Didn't get the attack in, but we still survived, which is better than nothing. Okay, lower that down. Okay. And there we go. Oops. Okay, good thing we went low there, because I'm pretty sure that might have been a one-hit kill. Though, I don't think the Sonic games really do one-hit kills. There we go. Or no, one more. Well, yeah, I know way too bit about Sonic about that. Yeah, typically and with also, Sonic it's the rule of three, I believe, but we've yeah, been and breaking that quite a bit. Let's be honest, no one likes one-hit kills in games. True. For it's usually... Like, I think I've seen it done well, but it's usually not. Like, okay, it's usually that... used as a cheap way to try nice to make a boss try, harder. Rocky. But it just makes it annoying. Yeah, that was a lot better than the ghost. Ooh, yeah. I think NASA might be missing something. So this is the space colony where Eggman is hiding. Uh. What? Is everyone all right? We should be landing oh, no. soon. The hatch doors Go. are all sweated, Knuckles. The only thing in the cargo bay are those what do you master mean, emeralds. Don't sweat it. Right? Land the shuttle and let me out. We're gonna crash this thing if you keep that up. Oh no! Don't touch that lever! Whoa! 
Okay, I'm pretty sure one of the mods was supposed to fix them overlapping with tech and their chatter, but they're well. With that knucklehead anyway, trying to take over the shuttle. I thought we were toast for sure. Huh? Where did he go now? Looks like he bailed. This place looks deserted, dusty too. This place was shut down about 50 years ago because of a terrible accident. The first Bernoulli spherical space colony called ARC. When it was operational, it was the most advanced research center of its kind. But looking at it now, now it's an abandoned arc, wouldn't you say? There's not much time left before Eggman fires that weapon again. We've got to hurry. Let's find the cannon and destroy it. Yeah. Someone designed that weapon to be impenetrable from outside attacks. Its defense shields are super strong, so we have to find a way to destroy it from inside. Isn't that a chaos emerald? It looks like it, doesn't it? But in fact, it's a fake one I created after researching the real emerald. It has the same wavelength and properties, but it's less powerful than the real one. It's designed to reverse the energy field inside the chaos emeralds and blow up. It looks so real, even a machine can't tell the difference. I'll find the power supply and destroy it. Sonic, you find the control room, okay? So the plan is, we'll switch the Chaos Emeralds when the machine is stopped, right? Okay. I hate you! You guys always leave me behind and have all the fun! fun. Okay, so, it, so the idea is take out the station's power supply to make this thing inhabitable, or at least I inhabitable soon enough, yeah. uh, uh, uninhabitable soon enough, and, till, and Sonic is to destroy the cannon, which probably has its own power supply. Uh, what is, what are these here for? That's okay. There we go. <laughs> Again, Dill's just showing off his arm strengths. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, the story is quite a bit more advanced than it was in uh, the first Sonic Adventure, huh? Definitely, though. I know that his dialogue in the first one was a little bit better in, in most areas. Yeah, it, it, I have oh, to what? say that Tails' line reads are a bit stiff here. But that's also something com that comes with a more complicated story. The, <clears throat> the dialogue needs to match up with it. Yeah, the problem is, it, when he talks, it, it really makes you feel like you're watching one of those older cartoons, in a way, if you get what I mean. Yeah. Like those from the 90s. Well, that... It, yeah. <laughs> okay, not there. Okay, we need to hit the button there. And yeah, we don't... We need to not hit those. And for those uh, wondering what I mean, like, there are many cartoons from the 90s, but the one I'm supposed to about them more like, Hey, kids! Today we're gonna do this! Yeah. Kind of. <laughs> oh, let's let's not destroy those. <laughs> okay, I like how they're I like how they're specifically trying to counter us just holding down the attack button to shoot everything. Because that's just going to have, that's just going to get us sucked out into space. Let's see the little thing about it. I think that most of those they did that for games before they thought kids would like this. And this is supposed to be in good. Problem is, when kids have heard kind of speak like that, they will get annoyed. Yeah, they'll they'll feel insulted instead. And hello, Lazarus, how are you doing today? Hopefully, we'll be hello, having a lot less mod problems. <laughs> Okay, I'll take those. Uh, come on, Tails. There. 
Okay, do we need to be on top of this thing or something? Let's see. Uh, Lazarus, happy music noises. I mean, hi. Now alive, that's about as nice as it gets. Uh, true. <clears throat> I have not mind rights. Yeah, that, that definitely blows all the balls. Uh, okay, seriously, what? Uh, where are we supposed to go? We can't. We don't have enough height to grab that. Uh, blow up the tank. Oh, okay, that moves the stupid thing back up again so we can stand on it. Or hopefully stand on it. Okay, I see now. I need to lure it. No, not lure it down. Hmm. Let's see. switch underneath. Okay, nope. Now we still don't have enough height to, <laughs> to get on top of that, though. Light spring doesn't go. Up. Oh, okay. That that's just a stupid bit of design. <laughs> Why would you have one spring be go lower than the other? No, okay, that, that just feels like a troll. A while. <laughs> right, I think we should ask ourselves: Why are the springs here to begin with? <laughs> a bit. Oh, hello. <laughs> Oh, come on. Okay, at least we got the checkpoint. And, uh, hello, fake chaos. What? Yep. Eggman hasn't been sitting still in his old ideas. Come on, give me a lock on on the... There we go. I think we need to hit it specifically when it's the, the hat is showing. This is what the machine is increased its learning. No, the, his machine is failing. You <laughs> notice the, cent, the bar in the center. Uh, Tails has, well, his normal ring count, but he also has, the, the mech can only take a certain amount of hits. Oh, okay, I, I thought it meant you're about the mobs. <laughs> okay, luckily we can refill it with rings, though. Oh, come on! Okay, yeah, let's see. Lazarus, ah, yes, the artificial chaos. The most bullshit enemies in the next stages, and I think I can see why. Because they're typically immune, and their attacks are really annoying to dodge. Okay. Okay, I think I figured it out. Just keep an aim on it, and the moment it shows the, the con <laughs> come on, the moment the the control unit becomes visible, we unleash and jump. Yeah, that, 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 that's a clip, ain't it? <laughs> uh, maybe. I'm, clip. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to focus more on trying to beat these things. Sorry, if anyone wants to clip that, go ahead. I want to use more just to write it down. Uh, let's see, 38 minutes or about 36 should catch that. <laughs> if I remember to clip it out. Okay. Hmm. I. Okay, did the platform just go too low there and won our last it life? It looks more like something hit you from behind and push you off. You might have been knocked out from the platform. Or knocked off. Okay. Yeah, it might have been that the platform went too low or something. Either way, ew, let's not get sucked into space. Uh, oh, okay, yeah, it goes low. It l gets lowered below. Ooh, the lasers. That, that was lucky. That was just pure luck on that. Okay, next checkpoint. Let's see. Any more artificial chaos? Nope. Okay. Yeah, gotta be careful with those. 
For some reason, Tails' mech feels clunkier now. Though it should have all the mods installed to make it easier. <laughs> Well, starting at the... <laughs> yeah, I already noticed that last, so let's go. let's do that again. My name is Miles Brown, but everyone calls me Tail. We managed to hotwire the space shuttle from Eggman's secret base, and finally arrived at the space colony, Ark. It was my idea to destroy that weapon using the fake emerald I made. I wonder if Sonic understands the plan. It's up to me to find the power supply and fast. I'm guessing he circumvented the autopilot because they kind of crashed into an asteroid. Yeah. Huh. Huh. Okay. Also, if, yeah, that, that was a good example, but I feel a bit off about Taze. It, it feels like having to let the cartoon I, I, I mentioned, but also. Almost towards like. Oh, what is a good thing? Something like a like a page or something? Hmm? Does that make sense? Uh, like a what? A Peppa Pig. Yeah, <laughs> yeah he, he, he does sound a bit. Uh, yeah. <laughs> the voice acting for me is just not that good. <laughs> Like, I know he's supposed to be young, but he... But unlike the others, he... <laughs> yeah, like, again... Uh, it feels like it's in the weird mix between a really young kid show and uh, something like, uh, yeah, the, those annoying, uh, very hip uh, cartoons. <laughs> that are not hip at all, it's annoying. Yeah, the, the tryhards. Yeah, the tryhards. Okay. For some reason, sometimes the mech turns a lot faster, and other times it doesn't. Mm. There. Oh, oh, no. There. Okay. <laughs> There, fuck off. Not the time to be annoying wee bit bot uh, messages. Yeah, uh, maybe have to send maybe censor that out. Okay. okay, the mech is about to break. Okay. Uh, let's see, 42. Yep. <laughs> okay, I should have remembered that stupid thing and it puts us over here. Yeah, it is actively drawing us out. Do you ever wonder why the other open air area is doesn't have us getting sucked into space? But I'm guessing it there's a a force field or something. I can see why Robotnik would steal this. Yeah. Or uh, what, mm, what would the more accurate word be? It is. Uh, I, I can't think of the word at the moment, but it's when people are living in a, a quote unquote abandoned house illegally. Yeah. It's that pushed me over. Okay. And of course, I fall for that thing again. Send you up. Okay, there we go. Okay, now we should be able to get past here. Oop. I say and immediately get hit. Okay. Out of this chaos. I jumped too early, I think. Oh, oh that, re that really does not heal a lot when you I wouldn't be get enough rings. I can screw you lots. Okay, gotta be real careful. 
Wait for that thing to start going up again. Probably should just go over to the side bits first anyways. Okay, luckily this... Yep, full restore. <laughs> There, we need to kill that one to get the door open. But this one, we don't. Okay, just, just screw the other <laughs> slime ball. Okay, there. And yeah, that's what I get for getting cocky. So keep that stupid button pressed this time. Checkpoints. Okay. Just trying to shoot the moment that the door opens up. Come on. Yeah, see. yeah, the artificial chaos are pretty much considered the worst enemies of the game, as I understand. And I can fully see why. Because they have a really small window of weakness. Okay. Yeah, though it does also make them understandable why he would deploy them. Yeah, still doesn't make them not annoying. Yeah, okay, give me those no, rings. That's been really here. What in uh, uh, the, 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 what do you what do you uh, okay? Save this. What do you have to play something that's anno is annoying for your voice to fight or fun for them to fight? The annoying. But as much as it makes sense in world, it's still freaking annoying to play against. That just means he, he's uh, being very successful. <laughs> there. Okay. Uh, random bombers. Yep. Definitely taking that. Yep. Uh, okay. Okay, that was a trick. Why did he somehow always remind me of those uh, droid guess, for some reason? Yeah, not, not everything that's a ball is a droidica. I know that, yes. I, I think it's more the head, and there was, as you said, annoying to deal with. Okay. I guess they have a similar road I have. Says both have a devil small point of weakness that is not easy to exploit. Yeah, let's see, these are remnant e experiments from when Gun ran the arc. It's a, uh, you know, it's why you're fighting gun robots rather than bad things as well. Okay, okay, yeah, that makes sense. Yep, and <laughs> those gets a bazooka. Vulcan cannon power up. You can now break iron containers that you couldn't break before. Okay. So now we can break the containers downstairs. Really? A bit? No, actually, uh, why well, have I learned some random fact about bazookas? No. I don't know, I don't know why they are called bazookas. Okay, why? It's the sound they make when you fire them. <laughs> okay. Or at least uh, that's what they felt like he was making, uh, at least the first ones they made. If I'm I pretty sure it's more of a bush. Yeah, that's, yeah. A, that's, that's a good little uh, <laughs> detail on that, uh, Lazarus. Thank you. Oh yeah, here it is. Another checkpoint. If we remote need all this is just... Uh... <laughs> uh, well, three resources. Okay, now we're just flying or hovering. I'm pretty sure you should be able to switch to flight mode in this, but okay. <laughs> He's so going to throw up after this. Okay, oh. okay they, they were they were attacking before we were even <laughs> before we even opened the door. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna read out from Lazarus here. They said it doesn't work, this clear quarter, Professor Robot thing shockingly. Okay. 
Okay, okay now we, <laughs> we just shoot everything. All right, gonna continue reading the letters here. I was pretty much in charge of the Ark science team and researched the crap out of things like Chaos, the Air Chaos Emerald, etc. Eight of them three rings, okay. Or total collected, I'm I guessing. Do better next time. <laughs> Anyways, we're done with that. Visit to the job world, but we're not really too interested in that. Uh, okay. yeah, just dropped all about that off, and then we should be able to safely. Yep, okay. Uh, yeah, the total collect means your total for child world. Okay, uh... Story. but don't tell me we need to do that again. Oh no. Sonic? Now put that emerald. Tails. Tell Sonic to meet you back at the research facility. Sorry, Amy is. I, I didn't get that, Tails. What happened to Amy? Tails. Uh, okay, uh, despite the mods, it seems that the the <laughs> the timing of that is still broken. But in the meantime, uh yeah, Knuckles is going to need to find those shards again, it seems. Uh, let's see, Lazarus um, has a mini area that has a shop allowing you to buy things like chow eggs, fruits, etc. for your chow. Okay, it's completely optional unless you're going for 100% emblems, which we are not. We're mostly going for the story and such. Uh, come on, nope. I'm seeing it. Floating containers, okay. Uh, where are floating containers then? Yep, we're near one. Pretty close. Between the inverted blue tower. Okay. I would like it if we could click those away ourselves. Very near. Down. Four big. Floating plot platform from the bottom. Big! Hmm? He reacted to something on the ground there. Now I, I think it's inside of this here. Yes, if it was uh, if it was close enough to dig up, then I believe the uh, it, okay that one went close. More of an exclamation mark over his head uh, when you ran along the wall. Oh. Is it that thing? There we go. Okay. Oh, that was right! Yeah, it, it should show that when we are close enough to dig it up. Uh, yeah, let's that's see, what that I was saw. it fourth from the bottom? That's what I reacted. That's why I said it was on the ground. Yeah, I let's saw see, it actually... pop up when you run past it. Uh, Lazarus, oh no, the voice timing from the English version of uh, Sonic uh, Adventure 2 has always been universally shit. It's a meme. It's also unmodable because it's just hard baked into the game, as I understand it. The Greencast version was just a horrendous. <laughs> oh, come on! That's <laughs> it by a freaking asteroid. And I'm. Um, oh, come on, that's just spiteful. Okay, I. I thought that one of the mods was specifically meant to unfuck that, but apparently they both well, just couldn't. Oh well. At least we didn't get too many of that before. No. Uh, okay, seriously, some of these have to be, be you know, have to be aimed. Like if we're standing too still for too long, we get punished like that. Uh, how do we get up, up there? Okay, then I think one down. It said something about the fourth one. No. Uh, oh, oh, wait, between the floating containers. It's flying around here somewhere. And yes, for some reason, some of the freaking shards move around in the area. Which is also really annoying. 
Uh, let's see. Nope, it's on the ground. You have the indicator. Uh, yeah. Welcome to Meteor Earth. It's a giant fuck off level that is giant. Yeah. At the very least, we have the hints. Though they're not going to be too useful all the time. And how the heck are you supposed to get up higher here? Well, you have hints and me and Lassie. Oh. Lash there we go. <laughs> Lashy. That sounds like a horrible nickname. It's also the name for a sort of a mermaid horse or something, I, be I believe. Or at least they're called that oh, for short. I think I know, know what you're talking about, or just I'm sure that's how it's pronounced. Uh, let's see. They say that Lash is fine. Alright, Lash. <laughs> okay, this one's not going up. And I okay. already uh, have a concerning mental image of them. <laughs> I'm pretty sure whips aren't allowed on Twitch, so we're safe on that. Hmm. Why do you have to say whip? No, I'm stuck with the where there's a whip, there's a way. <laughs> okay, so this thing does go up. <laughs> that are overlord, but well, one day. <laughs> A game I hope we'll be able to stream one day. Yeah, we, we showcased Overlord 2 at least. And not to, I don't totally remember how well it ran or not. I think it had uh, some slight problems. Hmm. But there might be, hopefully be some fixes for that. Hmm. Stay up, Knuckles. Yeah, this level has way too much verticality with this. Like, I get that they would want to play with the whole space thing, but I could have, they could have done that without making this level just massively vertical. Yeah. It is a bit odd, fun game, mine, but definitely wonky. Yeah, it definitely is that as well. I would not say it's fun, I would say it's hilarious. I mean, it's one of those games I played and uh, had a bit of love cramps in my legs from. <laughs> no, when I, I played it first time, it was on a PC, and then it was a bit wonky, then again, my twin had downloaded it. Come up. However, when I played it later again, I had, had first one or second one for my PS3. And it ran very smoothly, I say. Go, go, go on. So, there. maybe it would be better to play Overlord through a console? It, 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 it. There we go, got it mostly just by... One more left. Okay. It. Now, where is the last one then? Two rotating beacons. Okay, I'm presuming it means these things with that. Okay, any more computers to get a hint off of? Right. So at least get some height in case we do fall back down. Well, it's small meteoroids. Okay. Meteorites. Yep, meteorites. Uh, oh, uh, here. Meteoroids. Uh, you fucking sent me down again. Uh, but you did tell him don't send me down. Okay, is it amongst one of these here? Da 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 da. Wait. Is it right what? behind it's, it's the freaking spring? It's, it's near it. There was an explain it. There. Dig, 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 dig. There we go. Okay, that, that was a bad spot since you're easily going to hit the freaking spring. Yeah, I'm just glad I split it both times. The exclamation mark. So, it's a bit. This is probably one of the cases where. Have an extra pair of eyes will be helpful. Uh oh. Long time no see, treasure hunter. 
Did you buy my emerald? That's a good one. Your emerald? Talking to you is a waste of time. Okay. Well, if that's how you want to play, I will take it from you. Uh. <laughs> okay, just start off this match by standing next to each other instead of, you know. Okay. And uh, yeah, Rue is basically. Oop. The heck? Rue is basically placed to say. Oh, yeah, we don't want that. Yeah, she, she's throwing bombs or something. Okay. Some sort of black wave attack. Uh, let's see. What the, hell, what the hell was that? Yeah, Rouge is not supposed to stand next to you. <laughs> but what this is saying? Black wave. Oh yeah, it is. It's so quirky on the voice. So so weird. I thought it was blood wave. Okay, so we already have to be moving in order to dodge that. Now, where is she? There you are. There. <laughs> Knuckles is far from above punching a lady. And again, Rouge may not actually count as a lady. <laughs> Don't say that near her. Get away from my emerald. You you don't need to dance on our corpse, <laughs> Knuckles. <laughs> um. Stop fooling around and give, give me, me back, back my emerald. What are you babbling about? You call yourself a hunter attacking a lady? Shame on you! What kind of lady goes around stealing gems anyway? Those belong to me! Uh, you know you have wings, right? The heck was he holding on to? Keep your hands to yourself! Don't touch me. Is that how you say thanks to someone who just saved your life? Saving my life? Don't think I owe you one. You just wanted to hold my hand, didn't you? That's why you saved me. You're such a creep. This isn't a joke, you know. Think what you want, Batgirl. I was saving the Master Emerald. <sighs> no matter what you say, it sounds crazy. What? Fine, then just take them. They stink like a kidna's do. If that's what you thought, you should have given me them in the first place. Well, at least that's the master I'm more restored. Steel's trunk in the wash. Finally. What? I'm sorry if I hurt you. We should get going. Uh, okay. Crazy gadgets. That let's hear from Lazar. And that bit of a cat setup was never addressed again. Thanks, Sega. <laughs> Okay, now, now we uh, don't have. Uh, damn it. Now we not only have grind rails, we now have hang rails as well, it seems, see? Uh. You can change the gravitational force using the gravity control switch. Uh, go. Uh, come on. I, I think I, 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 I I'm gonna guess Lushers is one of those uh, Noctos and Rouge uh, chippers. Maybe. Do we need to yeah, stand somewhere I'm specific to activate that, uh... this? There. Now it finally works. Okay. Uh, I, I would probably also feel a bit annoyed if there's something that seems to be set up, but it's never touched again. So the old booms, I feel like, yeah, it should never be touched again. <laughs> 
There we go. Do get a question though. How did Gun know about uh, chaos? Yeah. Ah, right, bounce it. There we go. I forgot we had that because they're pretty sure this is the only game where that exists. Yep. <laughs> now Sonic gets to experience the Arc's pneumatic tube system. Not touching that. Touching that, though. I'm not uh, the ship. I just think it's a shame they put in a nice bit of character building and just completely ignored it. I agree with that. That I have to agree. Yeah. I, I think I have seen a long ago a video that seen the, the interactions. I guess they had slight more character building in their cartoons. Uh, there we go. <laughs> he just got this lot for some reason. I should clarify. It was one of those videos that were putting out every moment Rouge Rocket that they where they had sneak, sneaked in an adult jokes <laughs> into. Well, that was obviously the wrong switch. Okay, let's try sure this one. Oh, uh, okay, this one. Oh, ooh, nope. okay, now I see what's going on. Uh, okay. For first, Sonic's uh, uh, colors were bugged out, but now it's just dark in here. <laughs> yeah. There we go, I thought that was going to take a while. Uh, come on! Uh, that was going to take a while at that speed. Fuck uh, off. Okay. E. Bye bye. E. E. What? The okay, heck? whatever that was, it's gone. E. Oh, hello. Bye bye. Okay, then we got shields now. E. All right. Homing attack, and then light dash. There we go. Fancy! Speaking of fancy, I, I know pneumatic tubes are like considered ancient technique and technology, but I still think it's, you know, it's needed as all hell. Okay, for a moment I thought I was going to fall into the ce through the ceiling there. Okay. Now, enough Lionel Richie bullshit with this. I, I could see it returning if, if, if uh, something... Uh, if it would him a necessity. Um, like... Uh, it'd probably be one of those more talented yeah. technologies if, uh, you know... The apocalypse strikes or something. <laughs> Now, I think it would probably be too much, uh, take too much effort to really set up uh, such for that to be. Uh, unless it be. Unless it gets to a point. <clears throat> unless it be to a point uh, where we're already. Yeah, we, yeah, where the world would be returning to industrial revolution level of tech. But it would be uh, good and useful for sending around small, uh, small items and such. Documents yeah, can, can just be sent by mail or text. Uh, Alright, I, I get it. About if you lose electricity or something like that. Like, if you, you, you're in the wasteland, you find a... Good to use. There we go. Flame ring. This allows you to use a powerful fire somersault. Okay. Uh -oh. Yeah, thanks for the tip on that, Lazarus. Okay, now we can break those boxes so they don't block the way. Lazarus, what, what have you done? <laughs> the, 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 then again, Lazarus is new here. So he doesn't know. <laughs> um, Lazarus. 
The, the there, there's doesn't a reason. trust me with fire. <laughs> yeah. It, it, no, not okay. really trust Hillier with fire. <laughs> Okay, let's see back. Yeah, backflip a little on the ceiling. Yeah, upgrades. <laughs> I'm not a heck. I feel like I may have one day, as a joke, do a. As a Sophia seed inspired by SCP. Like, they will. All the other things Dr. Bright is not allowed to do <laughs> at the SCP Foundation. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm several countries away. Play with all the fire you want. <laughs> okay. That's them. It's not supposed to be a gift until after. Okay, there we go. And these artificial. Uh, oh, we, we. Okay, we kept it. Okay, yeah, let's confirm it. And those artificial chaos are not the brightest if they're just still firing at the same spot. And I think it's starting to hail outside or something, or at least rain heavily. Because you can hear things ticking against the windows. I'd love to take some hail. Like, I'd to take a haily... festive holiday over a rainy one. Like, seriously. Heavy rain during Christmas is depressing. <laughs> yeah. The only time we actually had a snowy Christmas in years was at the at the end of 2000, 2020. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's almost a second late on pressing that. Okay, for Lazarus. Oh, great items like that don't reset unless you you give over to my knowledge. Okay. The weather being held today here to stormy, hailstorm, rain, etc. Yeah, we, we've had storm rains for like the last three days or something. We need to, we need to destroy a tentacle monster. There, I was honestly expecting to get hit. Can we remain on the high roads? Yes, we can. And our reward is 15 rings. <laughs> Not worth it. <laughs> also, Eggman getting impatient on Sonic being not the fastest thing alive for like five seconds or so. It's like, wouldn't it be in, best in, your, in your best interest if he was slow for a while? Okay, grab that. Uh, out this way. Okay, was was confused for a sec there. Well the body sounds very different from the last game. Yeah, he's definitely putting in a lot more effort to be sprightful. Okay. Nope. Um. Okay, I took a risk and failed. And okay, that must be unloaded area over there. Hmm. Thinking on it, I don't think too many games these days still actually muck about with gravity changes. But it happens. Just... Yeah, not many do due to... How... Annoying it truly is to work with, and I see someone written something in the chat. Let's see, Grandmaster Player 4? Hilda's game hits so deep that it's really to the heart, makes your eye flow with tears, and it hits the soul as it punches reality into your soul and into your mind. Okay, I found we I think we found another fan here, Lazarus. Okay, seriously, where do we need to go here? Uh have you checked the map? There is no map. <laughs> 
We can jump up over here. If that... Pause bracelet. If that also works. Alright. I keep forgetting that power since it just... Uh, it's ex it only exists in this game. Oh uh, yes, I'm aware. Zero li extra lives left. Yep. Okay, that was different. Oh, you were uh, just about to die there. Accidentally. Actually, let's just skip that. Okay. Honest and bomb. Okay, just keep moving. We are getting to the end of the hero story, I do believe. So it <laughs> helps explain why the difficulty is spiking. Okay, at least we know what to do now. Yep, as long as I can make this function with the almost inverted controls. Yep. There. Yeah, th those things are really freaking annoying. Yep. Not passing by here without hitting that. Yep. I'm pretty sure putting glass on a pneumatic tube would be a really bad idea because if it breaks and you send something through, you're just basically firing a shotgun of glass at someone. Okay, there. Then we just flick neck that roll through. Yep, yep. 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 Come on again on the very same spot there. Okay. Hmm. Yep. Yep. Oh. Come on, the exact moment that I attacked there. Okay. Yes, yes, I wish I'll fuck off. Okay, let's wait out. Yep. There we go. Come on. Okay. But yeah, just because we're nearing the end of the hero storyline, of course, doesn't mean that we're close. Let's not pull that again. To the end of the game, since there's also still the other side of the storyline. Okay, probably faster just to pull this one. Yep. Okay. Yep. Come on. Okay, yeah. one of the reasons probably why they s not too many games mess around with gravity is because it can lead to dumb deaths like that. And the end is a harder design at times. Okay. And also, it's, it is rather tri trippy. But it really messes with one's brain. <laughs> Both the player and the developer. There. Okay, let's move the hell on. Yep. I think most people that does this still try to do a bit more simplified version that doesn't get too mind trippy. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Bye bye. Okay, here again. Just hoping it back a few times. But anyways, uh, how have you been, uh, Grandmaster Player? <laughs> Better than some of us, I'm hoping. Oi. Oi, oi, oi. What does he have of me? <laughs> what <laughs> Hello, is sweet stick here? Wait, what? Sweet care. Sweetest Rick here. Free, <laughs> sweetest speaking Rick here. Why do you say that? <laughs> just to tease I, you. I, I, I didn't start speaking Swedish. 
Now that definitely sounded Swedish. No, oh, that, that actually... actually I was just saying, why did I start to speak the British? Okay, there we go. There. Oh, wait, what the hell seems to give always as well? Nice! Yeah, apparently. Yunk. Might yeah, be because of a mod, least. but I I didn't see anything specific about that amongst any of the ones that they installed. It could also just be a sign of balance and mercy. It's probably well. means they know it's a hard game. And this is the Steam re-release. So it could have been that they changed some things in between. Very well, possible. That you could have you, you could have put her somewhere that isn't an absolute hassle to get to, and of course we need to kill the stupid tentacle thing again. Okay, at least these two are a lot easier than so this mindless. Of course. Okay. Let's try that again. Yeah, this, this is mostly because I'm being impatient. Not that the level is actually extremely hard or anything. Okay. Yeah, they, they just straight. Yeah, they just fire straight ahead and nothing else. Yeah, get rid of that. There. Okay. We've probably spent more time now on this than on Knuckles' levels. And they're supposed to be the annoyingly long ones. There. There we are. It's... Yeah, it... <laughs> nope. Ooh. Okay, let's try not fall. Get a life back. Yeah, with those... The artificial chaos and this pretty much... Yeah, a guaranteed hit on you. Sonic getting too... Called too slow for once. Okay, let's try to take this slower this time. Nope. Okay, well that goes to you for another life. Okay. The heck even happened there? You hit the initial field. No, but he, it looked more like he got thrown into the <laughs> into this floor there. Okay, let's avoid the stupid deaths this time. Okay. I'm pretty sure those things are actually calculating where you're going to be when you when they attack. So you need to abruptly move to ensure that they miss. And of course I still get hit. Come on. There. And of course, I'll probably forget that. <laughs> I'll probably forget about the bounce thing like five seconds after we need to, to use it on the other area again. Okay. Come on. One, two, three. Okay. Did they just. Yep. Explode because we got the bomb power up. 
Oh, I thought they shot each other. <laughs> no. <laughs> Would be nice, but no. Okay, not falling there this time. It, it, it does sound like a control. Sonic thing to do, to trick the Roopas to shoot each other. I'm pretty sure he does that plenty of times in the uh, shows. Okay, it's it's annoying to line up to that with the angle control. Come on, you uh, every single time with this one, huh? Okay. When it starts, when it shudders side to side like that, that's when it's going to attack. There, persistent strike that thing out of existence. Okay. Let's see, there's a small string of rings on that sideways uh, rail, so you can light dash on it. Okay, that, that would definitely help. There and there and there. See, that's why it's annoying to line up, you need to light dash it. Okay, yeah. I probably should be using the light dash a lot more, but since it's the, since its button is opposite of the jump button, which is a lot more work, uh, <laughs> going to be sure that it's going to see a lot less. Okay. The blind fire squad again. Okay. You guys wonder how exactly they're screwing around with gravity in this station. And how would not... <laughs> Eggman is probably getting real sick of Sonic just switching around to gravity every five seconds. <laughs> like, he, he's reaching for the button to make another threat, and he just <laughs> he just gets launched into the ceiling or thrown into a wall. <laughs> Actually, that might be why he's, get, why he's getting pissed. You can also be the gravity things are... They deal with certain areas. True, but it's it's funny to think of it like that. <laughs> oh dear. Uh. I feel like that has been a joke on some cartoons. Maybe. <laughs> it's a guarantee at this point. Gotcha this time. Now, so who thought it would be a good idea to give the artificial alien things uh, laser beams? Who do you think? Yeah, we needed to hit that first. Yeah, those are guns creations, not uh, Eggman's. So let's skip uh, that. Uh, apparently, if I was him, that is correct. Robotnik's grandfather, Robotnik, worked for gun. There we go. Emergency. Emergency. Yep. <laughs> Look at the most useless speed up uh, power up in the game. Uh, and the most useless dash pads, especially since you're supposed to hit this one in the middle. So the other ones are a bit not needed. Pull the lever. Okay. There, now we're back to where we were again. Oh! So let's... We... <laughs> we were that... from that... Oh, oh poor novel. I just realized that now. Okay, I'm five minutes in. Mm. Uh... Oh no. Okay, that was a gamble. Look, they think it's blowing very hot, hot outside and cold. I gotta close my windows. Then, I may have a okay, blanket, but... but... But once we get yeah. a, like a second of time to react by those stupid things... Uh, let's see, is this where we're supposed to go? We'll find that soon enough. Uh, it, finally, we're over here. 
we were trying to get to in the first place. Really? No. Yes. Oh, come on! Really? really? Yeah, instead of the light dash, he did the stupid flip. And you died! We're thrown at your goal! Uh, okay. Yeah, we, we know where the goal ring is now. <laughs> at least. Yeah. Okay, now it's not like the game is to uh, hang a piss at you. You want to go? Here! Shoo! Throw your dead at the goal! Yeah, this is why you shouldn't put two actions to the same button. Yeah, no worse. Mm. There'll be six uh, different actions on one button. No, it depends on how you angle that button and uh, an arrow button or something like that. Okay, here we go again. Let's see, I'm guessing those that green stuff is what, what marks the limits for where gravity can be screwed around with. Okay. This could be no. gravitation beams or something. There. Give me that. Okay, one more switch from the looks of it. Nope, no, more. Let's not forget that. Whatever it does. And something's just fi- <laughs> Okay, that thing's just rapid firing. Okay, well, you know what, screw- One screw you, Artificial Chaos. And for two, get the hell- let's get the hell out of here. Yes! Yes, indeed. Barely made it. What? Gold? Oh, gold ring! All right, all right. I, I misread that. Uh, I misread what Lustrous wrote in chat. And you know how the taste can be that bad for me at times. You might want to aim a bit lower. Business first, shall we, Sonic? Hand over the Chaos Emerald slowly, and then we'll talk about your girlfriend. That is, if you really care for her. Handing over the fake emerald? I can kill two birds with one stone. Say that loud. Put the emerald down right there and back off. Turned into a big time villain, Doctor. <laughs> Whoa. You thought you could trick me with that fake emblem, didn't you? So, how did you know it wasn't the real one? Tails! <laughs> because you just told me, Fox Boy. Oh. I'm counting on you, Tails. Take care of yourself. Farewell, Sonic the Hedgehog. Son! 
Kennedy asked me for the first time to do something for him. I won't let him down. I won't give up. And that was probably <laughs> his best idea ever. <laughs> okay, now we're at this again. Here we go, have a single ring. Uh, Yeah, aren't there supposed to be any rings around here? Or is this just a one-hit challenge? <laughs> well, yeah, sometimes the biggest, the best schemes are the simplest ones. Good. Okay, so we... Okay, we only have the, the, the next health, own health bar to go by. Yep. Oh, come on, I got knocked back into the beam somewhere by, by something there. Wait, was he putting out caltrops or something? The front of that opened up. Or I just spam randomly until I hit him. Or he just literally walks into it. Oh, come on, that thing in the middle hurts. Okay, luckily he's doing that instead of the big beam. Is he is he trying to plant mines around the place? I can't lose to tails. How did I miss that? I didn't expect you to win. How did I want to take you for, for a try? Hey, knuckles again. Some strange energy. Again, I guess it was a lot of straightforward boss fights. And off he goes. Yep, he copied the <laughs> he copied the chaos control that Shadow used. Okay, now I do believe that this level is liked by a lot of folks. I don't say chaos control. I, I just think of Henry Stickman games. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but there's a group called Center for Chaos Control. There. There's a, a payday in some of the games a few times. <laughs> yeah, when, when uh, too much it causes too much madness. Yeah. And yeah, then you know who the yeah. Center for Chaos Control are. <laughs> yeah, can I land on... No. Yep, I nope. don't question the myth at this time. Like, how will sending a giant mech robot Fix chaos. Yeah, by just stomping everything in a two mile area out. <laughs> and yeah, thanks for the camera switch there, game. <laughs> totally didn't mess up my aim. Oh, blame me the game now, eh? Okay. I don't know if leaning actually work does anything with this. Like, to me, it doesn't seem to cause any more speed up or anything. Like, it does help a bit with jumping from lane to lane. Oh, come on, really? Uh, yeah, rails is something that the Sonic games uh, always struggle with a bit. 
Those moose games stroke those railing. So what is that noise? It sounds like one of those wobbly things from the previous game in the casino park. Yeah, not casino park. Uh, oh, Pringle park. I know what. It, yeah, I know the sound. It's it's metal plates. You know the wobbly kind. Yeah. Okay, which of these is going to end? Need okay, both of them. Like, is that a funny sound, but Juicy, it's too much? Uh, I like okay, much? I, think it, I think it's supposed to be coming from the rail or something. I thought it was heard from those uh, circle things. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, missed whatever that reward was. <laughs> okay, no idea how you would be able to grab those. I just realized it doesn't have any space to. Yeah, I'm going to presume that there's a bit of a, an, an atmosphere around the place. I will hope so. There we go. Okay, I almost fell off there. Come on. We need to have enough speed to get up here. Yep, there we go. Get lost. Okay. Okay, straight forwards. <laughs> okay, screwed up rails. Uh, there, get rid of you. Now, what do we need to do here? Okay, just pick a hole and try not to glitch through the walls. There. Mm. Okay, uh, here. All right. I can, I, I've been watching some videos on other Sonic stuff and Sonic inspired games and apparently there are two that are really stand out. One of them is Freedom Planet and more specifically Freedom Planet 2, which is from what I've seen and heard an extreme improvement on top of the first. And the other is Sparks the Electric Jester, of which the first and second game weren't really too notable, but from what I've heard say on the third, apparently that is what people... You know, but a lot of people say what they wanted uh, for a Sonic Adventure 3 to feel like, and of course a misplaced homing attack throws me off again. Uh, you'd think that you could... Uh, you, sh yeah, you should be able to homing attack on the rails to get moving on with them. Oh dear. There. Okay, that was a bit annoying, annoying on the eyes for a second. Okay, now we're in the tunnel that we were on, on top of before. There. So, you, you, I will not be surprised if there is one for the Steam release. There. Okay. Not interested in whatever Oma Chow has to say. Okay, only got one spare extra life, the exact same fucking spots. You heard? I have heard of Freedom Planet. Like, I have heard we showcased it. We have? Yes. <sighs> I think I'm blanking out of that one then. 2D, I guess purple, uh. Character. I'm gonna look that up later. Okay, how how are you supposed to get up these things easily? Like they're a complete death trap. Now, screw it. We're bouncing.
Let's see. So far, I'm feeling really enjoying Freedom Planet. It's a neat 2D Sonic like. Yeah, the first, the first has its issues with it being you jump, jump dash. Not sure that's a move we've been told about. There's the homing attack. Um, hmm. Yeah, the, the first has its issues with being mostly a fan work. Uh, or a lot more unprofessional of a game, mostly in the sound setup and such. Uh, but uh, there's definitely a lot of charm. Oh, come on. What even happened there? Uh, I gotta guess you actually walked off of the, so the rail due to the damn camera blocking your view. Here we go again. Okay, and I'm starting to think it was more that people dread this level than actually like it. Because I'm certainly starting to get really annoyed by it. Uh. Uh, yeah, let's see. Yeah, was Freedom Planet was originally a Sonic fan game, as I understand it. I do believe so, yeah. Oh, I think I remember which one. Was it the one with uh, something like animals in it? Yeah. And the, the big mechanical snake, I believe. Okay, okay. I think the memories are coming back to me. I, I think I thought that one has another name. Okay, what did you think it was called? Well, not Freedom Planet for one. I just, I just thought Freedom Planet was the best game I have heard of or nearly seen. But I'm a bit surprised that one was Freedom Planet. Okay, we can look at putting Freedom Planet on the yes list, mostly because I hear, mostly because I want to. Uh, yeah, I mostly because I want to get the Freedom Planet 2 and see just how much it improves. And visually, I can say it improves a hell of a lot on just maybe that yes. aspect. I think we put it on maybe just media investigation. I think so. Oh, Your biggest complaint oh. with it was that it was going so freaking fast that it was making it hard to commentate. Yeah, and there was so much. I like, no, like, I'm fine with the voices uh, said the uh, story and all. Yes, it was so much talk and all that that you have to make it hard to go commentate on. And there were might also something. I think it was something else that made us most concerned. I think it was mostly you. Okay, I'm getting really freaking sick of these things not having a lock on. How far back did that put that put us back to the start of the level, didn't it? Yeah, or, no, not that, that far was... back, but still a good amount back. I think that's kind of the issue with the railing systems this early on in games that everyone hated for. I don't think there was a lock-on for railing things until maybe five years later with one of the Tony Hawk games or such. Mm. But there was an actual lock on against the uh, on two rails. Here we go. There. And there. It's also just the fact that for some reason sometimes we come to a dead complete stop on those. And of course this f oversized fuck guarding the entrance here. I can see why they never used rails that go upwards like this ever again, because you are a lot more likely to just throw yourself off the cliff than to actually manage to go up them, as as far as I've been lucky with them so far with this. Okay. Yeah. There. This was the last one that screwed us over, I think. 
Or was it over here? No, it was the previous one. There. Okay. No. Okay, it doesn't matter point. which of them screwed us over. Just need to get past the blast of things. Of course, I can hang one in the middle of the air. Screw you. What the? Mm. Oh, at least we have a checkpoint. Like, you were literally supposed to the homing attack on those things to get the speed to go up them. But they don't put in anything to ensure that you actually go up them. So, to actually land on them when they are specifically putting them in dangerous spots like this. Yeah. There. Okay, whoever thought that was a good design point should be fired, or <laughs> probably was. Okay. Progress, I think. Yeah. Uh, okay, you're just a complete dead stop for a second there. Wait, so, okay, so leaning does have an effect on your speed for some reason. Okay. Finally, a checkpoint. Okay, that was only saved by the fact that Sonic can act can actually climb up ledges now. I wasn't even saying what the tip of shoe tips. Like, it has big shoes. Okay, so that's the last one. There. Yep. Oh, come on. Yeah, I... I th I think I can clearly say that between Sonic Adventure 1 and 2, I'm going to favor 1 so far. Like, like, they do a lot of cool things here, but some yeah. things definitely should be having some extra thought through. Like, maybe we should not do this. And uh, apparently you just can't get up this thing. I guess they, you could say they've been a bit too experimental with this one. Maybe. The only way I can see of getting enough speeds. Okay, I don't... Last chance, and I'm half tempted to say that if this one fails, then we just call the stream early, because this is really getting on my fucking nerves. Yeah. <laughs> For me, it's making me nauseous, almost. <sighs> okay, how much time do we still have on the timer? Okay, 40 minutes. Let's give it one more try, then. Okay, but definitely... The people dread this level, not like it. <laughs> definitely corrected on that. The SA2 engine is kind of notoriously hard. I can see it, yeah. I think the people like it, like, they like the concept, but not the execution. Yeah. I think most people remember these games for the story, or this game for the story, not for bullshit un <laughs> underthoughts uh, design. Oh dear. Okay. There. Okay, this isn't pissing me off as much as Sekiro did, but it's still really getting on my freaking nerves now. Also, we're on the we're reversed on the rail. Let's see. Most people who remember these stages fondly have finished the stage very often, and so don't struggle at much. At it much. Yeah, probably who, people who probably instinctively know how to figure out to get around the bullshit bits. 
Так. Now, one thing I did notice, it does look to be a lot safer if we try to homing attack the, uh, <clears throat> the vertical bars at the lowest end, where it's red. It does seem to look uh, to lock onto there a bit. Nope. Nope. Can I get back? Nope. Can we? Mm. <laughs> okay, actually pulled that off. Okay. Did <laughs> you just pull off a speed rubber trick accidentally? Maybe. Either way, I'm taking it. Okay, someone clip that. 155, and I've already forgotten the times of the other possible clips. <laughs> oh, last press. Nice save. Yeah, I, I was Angry. up until the last second there, I was pretty sure I was going to miss it. And that was just barely a save on that. Yeah, for it, I also don't want to know. You wouldn't allow you to do that, would you? They, for most times, games developers will intentionally prevent you from doing that when you just stay but Yeah, by putting in death planes. Okay. Uh, I kind of happy that they did not uh, fix that. <laughs> Clip face. Yeah, no, music. Which being iffy again. Okay, thanks for the try anyways, Lazarus. Yeah, I think I figured these bleeding things out. Go for the, the darker colored parts. They do seem to lock on there. Or somewhat. They're easier to hit, that's for sure. I'll take it. Not how that was intended, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Now leave me alone, Blobby. <laughs> what would actually be scarier? Artificial chaos? Uh, oh, or that Blobby the Clown thing? It spawned from a joke. Uh, let's see, one other trick is to, to those grind roses to not be too close to them when you're homing attack. It makes it easier to aim. Yeah. Give me there. What about the blob? I don't remember if I told you about that damn thing or not. Yeah, the, the one that was started out for a prank thing, but children actually liked it, or at least claimed to like it. So they made well, an actual but... show of it. The middle of your show, it was the, the, the TV show, uh, the, the BBC themselves who claimed she didn't like it, but they didn't. <laughs> is that fast enough? No. Okay, this thing is like those rigged uh, strength meters or something. It... Let's see, is there any other way? Okay. Barely freaking short. Okay, B to... That actually speeds you up. I, I thought it was meant for getting underneath and getting through sh short places. Okay, that, that definitely speeds you the fuck up. Almost okay. too fast. Thank you on that one, Lash. <laughs> the local Sonic expert <laughs> coming okay. in again. I, I, let me just look away, happy like. Okay, that might have been a bit too fast. <laughs> okay. There. And there. And there. Okay. Yeah, that, that is a significant speed up. <laughs> Don't even need to do those stupid things there. Let's see, I'll admit I forgot about that bit. It's never really needed until that point. Yeah. Uh, oh. Junk. Oh. Okay, this has to be the most one of the most undignified <laughs> runaway sequences from just a bunch of space junk. Yes! Okay, and done with that. Oh, finally. Uh. Six, oh, wait, six minutes. <laughs>
About six hours. Barely made it. Oof. Yeah, uh, thank you, <laughs> thank you on that lash. Now let me make down a quick note. Uh, somewhere in the 30s, somewhere in the 40s. And 155. You never cease to surprise me, Blue Hedgehog. I thought that capsule you were in exploded in space. You know what can I say? I die hard. You actually saved me, you know. It was a Chaos Emerald, wasn't it? But there's no way you could have activated the Chaos Control using an Emerald that's fake. So, there's more to you than just looking like me. What are you, anyway? What you see is what you get. Just a guy that loves adventure. I'm Sonic the Hedgehog! I see. But you know, I can't let you live. Your adventure days are coming to an end. And so you gotta say though, after suffering through to that game over, that went really smooth on the rerun, yeah. And boss battle against Shadow. Okay, we're just chasing after his ass like that briefcase in Hitman. There. Okay, it'll get so starting to fall. Yep. No, not the roll. Hello, Shadow. Okay, it's another race. We just need to get in enough hits on him that we can't quite easily get ahead of him. You got the idiot hoping attack immediately. So, I don't think this counts as you being speedier, Shadow, if you're just teleporting ahead. And again, he is roller skating instead of running, so technically he is not as fast on foot as, Sh as, as Sonic is. Yeah. Hmm. Oops, time to fall again. Yep. You can actually crazy. collect those as well. Okay. Yes, the ultimate cheats. Now get back here and take your homing attack. Okay, I think he's trying to attack right as you. Our attack is supposed to land. Thought I'd get him just as he teleported in. Go, go, come on. Uh, yeah, but if he gets ahead, he just teleports ahead. Yeah, he's totally cheating. <laughs> the somersault that slows us down to a crawl immediately. That no. And okay, see you in a bit, uh, Lash, if we're still busy by the time you're back. And enjoy your dinner. Mm. I think they are already ate. Yeah, they, they said they're just... They, they just said that they're going B or B for dinner. It's a dishes. Yep, yep. Oh well, <laughs> I hope the view that would make the dishes was worth it. Stop doing the stupid. Okay, so that's what he does when the, he, you use his chaos spear. Okay, don't turn, don't look back, Shadow. Come on. Okay, that would be too easy if he could just fall off and we'd win like that. But you were to go to the floor first. This is the 
Okay, then how are we supposed to reliably attack him if he's just going to be a cheap ass like this? There we Okay, just spam the button. Uh, did I just get turned? I just got turned around. Okay. I'm pretty sure the camera is only supposed to point in one way in this level. Uh, thanks for the useless info as usual, Omachao. If I did what to do with Omachao, just... Yeah, did it really land that uh, idea well. Yeah, did it? Did, did I get... Okay, if I do that too much, the camera gets freaked out and launches us in the wrong direction. Seems to be working all the <laughs> just well as is Omachao. It's only once he has been hit twice that he gets annoying to hit. I'm pretty sure we can't run him over as he teleports in because he teleports in too far ahead. Okay, and that somersaulting does not work as well on dodging the Gaia Spear as advertised. Okay, at least got a cheap hit there. Okay, he got thrown off again. Okay, two more hits, I think. Not falling for the that again. Hmm. Hmm. Do I just have to hope for a lucky shot too? Of course, the moment he stops so we can get an attack in, we're going too fast to actually hit him. Okay, so basically we have to hang behind him, so he can try and do Chaos Spear. And whilst he's on the attack, we attack him instead. Okay. Kind of going against the whole thing being supposed to be being about speed and such. Does he need to pick up a certain amount of rings before he'll do it? Surprised if he needs to take a set of other rings for you to do some special strikes, but mm. and again, one of the many reasons why people really don't like Omacha because practically all information that they give is absolutely worthless. Time to put this to rest. Hmm, okay, my guess... There, okay, that, okay, so he needs to get a certain distance ahead, a certain distance ahead, then he'll do Chaos Spear. We need to get a bit lucky with, yeah, dodging it with the somersaults. And then we can land a hit on him. Come on, do it. Uh, 
Okay, he's going to teleport ahead. Hmm. If you're going to use that trick to just get ahead, you might want to be at speed already when you do. Game over, Shadow. <laughs> okay, that's done with Arca Bennett Lab. Sonic, I did it. supposed to prevent that thing from firing again? Ah. It said he was the slam dunk it. <laughs> okay, so he did get the fake emerald in. And that's the hero side. So we need to go through the dark side still. Okay, now okay. I can maybe deep continue to get this part over done. And of course, that isn't the true ending. Well, I don't show up, don't criticize. Wait, you need to... I'm just living by my own feelings. And I won't give in, won't compromise. Cause I only have a stand. Let's see, last race, yeah, rather than uh, likes on a convention one, clear all stories to unlock the, to unlock the last story. Though so this time we don't have to spend as much time fishing to get it. Now I can't tell if he's just being stunned or if he's just fuming at the moment. <laughs> Oh, me? Really? Yeah. Oh, I, I just don't sound due to the music. <laughs> Let's see, Lactress uh, only still six main characters. We have two main stories featuring three characters each. It should probably come as no surprise that you know, this game was kind of the start of my Robotnik fanboys. And yeah, <laughs> basically if it wasn't for the fake Emerald, Sonic would have been fucking dead there. Okay, no, I don't remember what to say. <laughs> Is the true ending a dark ending or something? I was the host. No, we need Until to go. I... We need to go through with the dark side story, and then the true ending will uh, become available. Hmm. Yeah, I figured that was as uh, Lazarus even said that, as I got silent and said by the music. And yeah, the dark side story is going to fill in a lot of blanks because, well, we're going to see everything from the villain's perspectives. Like, where the hell did Shadow come from in the first place? And stuff, you know, stuff like that. Which, for, well, Sonic fans is long known, but I'm pretty sure you don't know, so that'll be curious to see what you think of all of that. I know what he's, where he's from. Yeah, uh, what? <laughs> it's a Martian, obviously. <laughs> 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 Wait, what? Don't they do movies? <laughs> Let's see, Lashris. I always like the characters, but this is very much the start. Yeah. <laughs> this is basically Eggman at his prime, and his most evil as well. <laughs> you can now select scenes from the hero story. You can now select time attack. You, we will not be doing that. And two player battle stages, level four unlocked. Also, not really interested in that. Man steals the research from a military base located on an island to the south. The military's top secret weapon, Shadow. Sealed in the space colony park, the Seven Chaos Emerald. When all of the keys have been collected, world conquest will be at hand. 
Sonic Adventure 2, The Dark Side Story. Long live the Eggman Empire. Okay, I did not know that that was there. <laughs> Let's see. Lashus, everyone thinks had some fantastic character moments later as well, and not just in the games. Archie Comics Robotic, for example, was fucking terrifying at times. Yeah, he also just somewhat recently, like a few years back, he <laughs> unleashed a robot zombie plague, basically. Oh, I saw, I saw some clip of that on YouTube this year. And I thought, okay, what the heck is this? I was a little bit of okay. I, forgot, I think I watched, finished watching it, it was a short clip, but it did make me go look at Robotnik a bit differently. Let's see, that's IDW, Comic Robotnik, Grandmaster Player. So Amy X Sonic could have been... Yeah, they, <laughs> they could have been. But Sonic cares for Amy, but Amy is just too much with it. It's just... <laughs> she is, Every every time they meet, she tries to just smother him, and well, Sonic just wants to run free. And no, hello. Okay, so we could, yeah, we could take on specific bosses. Uh, also, and... I had to say this about what we just saw there. I like that narrator there a lot. It felt so epic until he said Eggman Empire. Yeah, this. <laughs> It's a bit hard to take that word seriously. And hello there, pizza. You can see coming out of the lurk. Uh, Lazarus. And yeah, the Zombie Plague series was incredibly well done. Uh, though my favorite Volatnik moment in the IDW comics actually comes after the Zombie Apocalypse storyline concludes. Volatnik has a few s silly issues, a few setbacks, and then shit gets real, and Volatnik just absolutely rises to the occasion and completely destroys everyone. <laughs> Yeah, Robotnik's biggest weakness is his own ego. If he if he manages to bash that down a, a few pegs, he would, well, he would just plain win. <laughs> Let's see, he basically gets up and does, yeah, this is why I'm the main villain, bitches. <laughs> Story select. Okay. Let's get some of the dark story in. Intruder alert. Intruder alert. Security, Security breach at gate, at gate 3. three. Shut down the research because they feared it. So it's, yep, we finished with the hero sides. And we're getting some of the dark side in whilst we still have some time on the stream. And finally, some good info from Omachao. <laughs> Okay. And this looks a lot like the prison lane, but then again, it's a gun facility as well, so it make, makes sense that they look pretty much identical. Level 2 security door breach. Level 2 security door breach. It, it, <laughs> I was not supposed to jump over that. Let's see, Lazarus, also Sonic Frontiers, uh, Robotnik was fantastic, he actually gets, you know, got character development, <laughs> actually well done character development. Yeah, I, I've heard nothing but praise about Sonic Frontiers, and I am, I am going to buy that eventually, but for the moment I think we'll stick with Sonic Adventure 1, 2, Heroes, maybe Generations, and the Rush games for streams. I, I might put Generations along with Mania, since that's also a Sonic game that I've heard only praise about. Oh dear. Uh, let's see. Pizza, uh, I shall go back into Lurking in the Shadows and come out when you see you guys end to, to suggest Raid. Okay, Pizza. Oh yeah, for the tea. Oh, hello, Pizza. Oh, what the heck? I am sluggish today. Hmm. Level three 
Okay, this this is an example of why Robotnik is actually a threat to anyone who is not Sonic and friends. Like he is just absolutely blasting his way through a top secret military facility. In a in a walker that's basically just a pair of legs and a gun. For me personally, Mania is the best of the two, but that's partially because I grew up on the old 2D Sonics, I suspect. Yeah, my first interaction was with the uh, 3D Sonics, so my bias lies a lot towards that, but... Okay, that was a cheap... that was a cheap one. Yep. Oh dear. Do it again. <laughs> yeah, it was nice. <laughs> But yeah, I'll, I I think I'll put Generations and Mania in one grouping of streaming. But I think with the ones that I've already selected for streaming in the near future, that we've got enough Sonic to go around for the moment. So I may put I may put them after the second batch of Star Wars games that we've got planned. Though we may want to take a bit of a break from Sonic after just so much Sonic. Uh, this was Sonic the Order was Star Wars? Yeah, the order was three Sonic games, then three Star Wars, or rather the Jedi Knights games, or Dark Forces slash Jedi Knight games. Then the... Uh, uh, then the Sonic Rush games, and then a few more of the Star Wars, I believe. Uh, I, I, thought it, I, thought it, I thought I did remember that correctly, but I was... Wondering, wait, where did we to do one more Sonic with Star Wars? I was thinking that, as well as. <laughs> okay, that's some heavy duty shielding. Uh, so I think we already have what we're going to need to break through that. Yep. <laughs> Maybe they should dead sort dead? these places out a bit better. Yosh! Okay, that, that has to be leftover Japanese as well, <laughs> with Knuckles. Yeah. But that's basically just... That yeah! <laughs> I'm guessing we could call this thing the Yoshi, since he keeps saying Yosh. Smaller than I expected. Enter user data. Uh -huh. Enter password. Password is Maria. Maria. Now all I have to do is to place the Chaos Emerald into this console. We had another example of him being smart. This time he actually found all the, most of the damn things before he started his <laughs> scheming. So kind to release me, my master. I will grant you one wish. Now what? Behold the true power I possess. I think you're a bit confused, Shadow. You're not a genie. This is Scorpion Troops Hotshot. Enemy movement has been detected. En route to intercept and destroy. Copy that. 
<laughs> Big Lash with all the true power I possess. Jet skate boots. <laughs> okay. And yeah, basically Shadow controls pretty much the exact same as Sonic, I believe. Yeah, three different characters on both sides, but basically we're playing as three different characters throughout the entire campaign, which is different skins. Hmm. There might be some differences. Yep. Yeah, there might be small differences, but if there are, then I, I don't think I'm going to notice them. There is definitely a difference in, uh, in the boss, though. So it now has the big the gun. Was... Okay, I could the masters. What difference? They all are very minor. All right. Yes, I. That's pretty much. Yeah. yeah. Ruth, I know she loves gems, but I am sure she would dig for them. Okay, two salvos, three salvos, and go. Troops hot shot. The enemy is stronger than expected. Request additional support. Oh, he's going for the double. Not that he can keep track. No, triple. Okay. Someone is getting daring with their energy, the energy supply. Good. Okay, one, two, and three. Oh, come on. There we go. <laughs> Pathetic humans. Destroying um. that guard robot was spectacular. So, Shadow, you are the military's top secret weapon. But what did you mean when you said you will grant me a wish? Bring more Chaos Emeralds. Shadow, wait! I'll be waiting for you in the central control room on the Space Colony Ark. Ark? Okay, so we didn't get most of them beforehand. <laughs> These two again. talking about that emerald's mine you got that the master emerald contains special powers that neutralize the energy of the chaos emeralds that makes it very powerful what the <laughs> look who's calling who at me I can't uh, right because he was looking for the emeralds here if i'm not mistaken this is the master emerald is it not it's you Dr. Eggman. So that's Dr. Eggman. Well, I guess I can use it for something. I'll just take it with me. Farewell, knucklehead. Not if I can help it. What? Ah! What was that all about? And look what you did to my emerald! I did that to prevent the Master Emerald from being stolen, you idiot. If it's in pieces, I can restore it. And by the way, that's not your Emerald. It doesn't matter. I'll look into it once I get back to the base. Again, zero bucks. I despise anyone who takes tools from me. All the world's gems are mine to keep. Yeah, we'll see about that, Batgirl. And yeah, we get to play as Rouge. Now, give me a check, a sec to check on the chat. Uh, yes, apparently gun uh, keyboards have double uh, letter keys, hence why Maria is a three input password somehow. Uh, let's see, da, 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 pretty much with difference. There's one big difference, and for that, I will actually suggest you go back to Nox, the second most annoying stage, and by that I mean drip drip the stage. Guardian of the Master Emerald, fuck it, shout the thing. But it does make it harder to steal once it's scattered across half the planet. Okay, on the hexagon pillar. Okay. Oh, very close by here, one. 
Let's see, yeah, we can probably finish up after this level. Are we getting closer or not with this one? Further away. I see her climb and glide. Like, her gliding makes bloody damn sense. Yeah, since she has wings and all. I got closer there, I think. Yep, there it is. And What's I, making that sound? I think that's supposed to be Chowder that's supposed to be hanging around here somewhere. So it, it sounds like they're... It sounds... It sounds like orgasming turtles. <laughs> Case in point. Uh, let's see, last risk. The reason you need to go back to Drip Drip, by the way, there's a character up right there that allows Knuckles to breathe on the water. <laughs> Without it, Knuckles' a segment in the final story is damn near impossible. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. I'll have to look around for where that is hidden then. Actually, I'll make a note. Uh, find Knuckles upgrades mine. Okay. Nope, it's a turtle with two robots next to it. Okay, so it is an orgasming turtle. <laughs> it's a very busy turtle. Follow the red pillar. Okay, which of these pillars is red then? And there's multiple red pillars. Or is there more room to this somewhere? And that's all the hints, it seems. Hmm. They sound so bloody. Some of the turtle are next to us all the time. They're good all shall. Oh, that's the turtle. This is it. Okay, it's. <laughs> Apparently, uh, it's a turtle with a scare king. Or. <laughs> it's Glacier says that we need it to get to the next part of this stage. Uh, we can stick on top of it, but it's not really doing anything. That's, that's a huge uh, there we go. It was just being a nuisance for a second. Oh, we are really close to one of both of them. Let's see. HD Lance Flare. Okay, where can I spy one of them from here? Here maybe? No. Hmm. Oh, I, I saw it on the left there. Okay, just need to get some heights. There we go. Okay. And the other way. Okay. This is basically a reskin of Wild Canyon with Knuckles. Nope, going away again. Hmm. Yep. Place where water comes from. Yeah, on the water. Okay. Got some air. Oh, there, this thing is hollow. Okay, how do we get in there then? Also, annoyingly, the camera controls. For horizontal are inverted. Oh, there's a gap in it there. It looked like there was. Okay. The there. map is it's focus E. As you look at proper camera control yeah, there. Yeah, there's a shard there. That's what made. Hmm. See, there's a second turtle that you can ask. You got the worst emerald piece for this stage. Okay. Yep. There it is. What is so something? So far, uh, so close yet so far. Okay, it's not inside the little area. 
Okay, that's there's also something about the turtle that we can grab onto here. That might be the... What we need to do here. There we go, I need that some speeds up. Okay, just gotta... Hope that it gets to there quick enough. We're actually going through here. Uh, okay, nice, but this is not where we need to be. That's the stream timer. And of course it goes the wrong way. Okay. Almost. Okay. There we go. Got it. Third time to charm. Really? There's jiggle physics on her ears. I. I'm ashamed to call I myself will a hunter. say that's. I would say that's okay. The jiggle physics on the ears. I, I, I would say that's okay. As long as it's on the ears, I'm fine. Yeah, big floppy ears. <laughs> yeah, yeah, considering where else they could have put that. Yeah, but I always most thought she had for a moment in time. This pyramid. Let's take the first skin first, then get inside. And okay. Fix it for I am. I am close to collapse, if you like. <laughs> okay, let's head on over here then. And Pizza, you have someone to yeah, suggest, or are you <laughs> are you still awake here? Still, I'll go take a quick look through the people who are online. Uh, the, no. Okay, I really, I really should trim the list here sometime. Uh, no. Let's... first. <laughs> allow me to summon pizza from Lurk. Um, <laughs> pineapple. <laughs> okay, that, that might scare him off. That might be poison to them. Uh, okay. There's but... something worse than pineapple, actually. What? TV and mustard pizza. <laughs> okay, there he is. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. Apart from uh, the final rush bit kicking my ass, that was still a lot of fun. <laughs> and apparently, apparently pizza is actually allergic to pineapple. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. Hmm. I think, I can't remember now, but I think I've had pineapple on pizza a time or two, and I don't think I hated it. Don't think I really loved it either. Yes, yeah, uh, Let's see. Pizza I has... I tried it, and decided to eat it aside. Okay, I just needed to type in five letters, then I immediately showed who you wanted, to, <clears throat> wanted us to raid. Let's see, they are playing Undertale Yellow. Okay, is that a fan game or something? Because I I haven't heard of anything Undertale... Uh, I forgot the name of the creator. <laughs> uh, I haven't heard anything about uh, Undertale and its creator since Deltarune. Yeah, hmm. and only maybe it was in reason they finally made a Chapter 2 or something. It took them hmm. quite a long time to make the Chapter 2 even. And I don't okay. think I've seen anyone play it. But yeah, let me take a quick look through the rest here. We have Hisayo, who is playing Spyro the Dragon. Uh, Big V Streams is playing Dungeon Keeper 2. Now, that's one that I haven't seen in a while. Um, Dungeon Keeper 2. I, I played the first one. If we had sort of the second one on a burnt disc that someone gave us a long time ago, but it didn't work. Okay. I... Okay, I'm blanking now on if I managed to get myself a copy of the disc, but I don't think so. Anyway, let's see. Pizza says, I don't know, I haven't watched him in a while since I uh, don't uh, got time. Okay. Uh, yeah, that, that is a classic Lash Riz. Dungeon Keeper 2 is a bastard to get running on newer systems, yeah. Okay. Let's copy the name. Head on over to our place. Come on, there we go. And slash raid. Oops. And paste. Almost mistyped. 
and yeah <laughs> okay lucky that we got the game uh, yeah, lucky that we got the game to work with the mods without breaking too much and yeah definitely looking forward to continuing this next week though it of course we'll be going through it a lot faster than Adv sonic adventure one since there's a lot less uh crossover between the storylines so this is just two lines yeah <clears throat> okay though i have heard that the final boss of this game can be an absolute terror so we'll have to see how long we go on that and hopefully my <laughs> hopefully my controller will survive <clears throat> anyways controller, monitor pc table bed <laughs> chair you know Depending on how angry you get. Yeah, and I, I'm already low on cash, so replacing those would be an absolute bastard as well. Anyways, th <clears throat> before we go raid, of course, thank you everyone who has been watching now or later. Thank you, Lazarus. Thank you, Pizza. And we have a few uh, yeah, a few uh, others. So thank you, Grandmaster <laughs> Player 4 as well. And one name here I'm going to have to check against a bot list. So sorry if you aren't. And if you are a bot, then you don't have the mental capacity to care anyways. <laughs> and as always, thank you, Dirk here. You're welcome as always, my friend. And thank you all for joining this madness with a crazy captain and a sickly lizard. <laughs> yeah, again, if you at one any point feel too sick to stream, just say so. Though tomorrow we'll have a day off anyways, and then we get into our weekend shenanigans with Dawn of War 2 Retribution and a Potheon. Oh yeah. And uh, yeah, I'll, I will let you know if I get too sick. Okay. But for now then, uh, let me get this there. Let's get that rate started. And thank you all again for watching now or later. And until next time, have a nice day. And until then. Be safe for everyone. Watch out for undead seagulls. And, and Dr. Robotnik when he's actually competent. Oh, yeah. <laughs>